Meet the Martins, Jim, Sheila, Sarah, and Trevor. Jim just opened up his most recent summer electricity bill, and lo and behold, it's significantly higher than previous years. Their summer electricity bill has been steadily rising, and Jim's tired of not knowing why. He and his family work hard to conserve energy in their own ways, and while they're not perfect, he thinks they do pretty well. In fact, as you would imagine, many factors go into calculating Jim's electricity bill each month. If he knew the reasons behind the increases, it might not drive him up the wall so bad. The biggest culprit over the last few months has been the temperature. As can be seen by the data collected for the months of May, June, and July, summer has been getting progressively hotter than the years before it. Of course, when the sun comes out, on come the air conditioners, fans, and dehumidifiers. And because it's warmer in the house, refrigerators and freezers are running more. And though Jim hasn't thought too much about it, this has been the major reason his bill has jumped so high. To get a better understanding, Jim visited the powerstream.ca website. This site has information on conservation programs and detailed personal usage data that helps him better manage his electricity costs and helped inform him about when his electricity was being used and determined where other costs were coming from. For example, the price to produce the electricity the Martins and millions of other families just like them use every day is derived from the cost from generating companies, transmission companies, regulators, and other important market participants. This group of companies involved in bringing power to homes and businesses all add up, but during the summer, the price to produce electricity from generators can make up the biggest charge on Jim's bill. That's not to mention that Jim is also paying for water and wastewater alongside his electricity bills. PowerStream collects these charges on behalf of two of the municipalities in its service territory. Recent drought conditions have led to increased consumption of water as well. Thankfully, Jim has restricted his lawn watering, but his neighbor Sue has another problem. She has a pool, so her electricity and water bills are even higher. Want to learn more about managing your account? Visit powerstream.ca.